Hi folks. This is a herb grinder. Take of that what you will. Um, if you want to comment, subscribe, press the bell for um, notifications if, if I put another 3D print time lapse out, etc. Um, I'm going to go through a different video and show you how to change the filaments over, change the different types of filaments. I know there's quite a lot on YouTube already, but I'm a newbie at this, so <clears throat> you might as well learn from all my problems and mistakes. Um, it prints very well now. Well, it printed very well when I first got it, to be honest. The the little teddy bear, what you get as a as a print test, comes out very well. But after that, then um, don't expect it to be perfect every time. That's what I'll say about 3D printing. Um, you might get a problem, you might get this, you might get that. But all in all, it's a very good experience and it's well worth doing because you end up making stuff and saving yourself some money as well. Don't forget as well, you've got a heated bed on this on an end of three which is a big advantage for different uh, filament types to help it stick to the bed. But Prit Stick will be your friend on a glass bed if it doesn't stick. Because I don't know why mine doesn't stick on a glass bed, but it doesn't. So Prit Stick comes to the uh, rescue. This is um, the cutter part of the uh, herb grinder. And I've gone and put the bottom on twice. That was clever of me, wasn't it? Anyway, so... Uh, yeah, I'm going to do some other videos, so comment, subscribe, comment on what you would, if you want me to uh, um, just run through something again, I don't mind doing that. Um, I've got a print off a, a camera mount for my hat so that I can actually do that, and a few mounts, GoPro mounts, etc. There again, that's what it comes in handy for. So please subscribe, comment, like, press the bell. Um, if I'm doing something wrong, tell me. If you need some any help with anything tell me on that and I'll see if I can help you we're not far off the end now so I'll bid you goodbye